Investigators believe a cigarette may have caused the fire that took the life of a Robbinsdale homeowner. Yeah, I mean, I've known him all my life. Friends say 66-year-old Michael Shule lived alone in the home on the corner of 34th and Halifax Avenue North. WCCO's Bill Hudson tells us neighbors called 911 when they saw flames coming out of his living room windows. Boarded windows and broken hearts now fills this close-knit Robbinsdale neighborhood. Yeah, I mean, I've known him all my life. Like many, David Heil is shocked and saddened. Just before 9 last night, neighbors reported seeing flames in Michael Shule's living room. I really can't say. I don't know. I know he fell asleep in his chair. It's all I know. Firefighters arrived in just minutes. The neighbors reported flames in the, the windows and the front porch, and that's exactly what we saw when we arrived. The 66-year-old was pulled from the home, but it was too late. The sirens and the streets were all blocked off and the lights were gone. Jeanette Heil knew Shul since he was a child and knew he smoked. She fears he fell asleep with a lit cigarette. Things happen. It just, um, it's really kind of sad. It's very sad. Neighborhood friendships built over the years, taken away so sadly and suddenly. Bill Hudson, WCCO, 4 News. The state fire marshal's office is assisting in the investigation for an official cause.